how are you all doing? I hope everyone is doing great and having a good time so far. So I am here with another video that is about insurance. I will be telling you that what is insurance, what are the types, uh, how are you eligible to apply for it and further details about it. So before starting the video, I would like to request you that if you are someone new to our channel, kindly subscribe our channel. Do not forget to press the bell icon to get notified and also like our channel and do not forget to share with your friends and family. So moving towards our video. What is insurance? Basically, insurance is a contract represented by a policy in which an individual or entity receives financial protection or reimbursement against losses from an insurance company. The company pools clients' risks to make payments more affordable for the insured. Insurance policies are used to hedge against the risk of financial losses, both big and small, that may result from damage to the insured or her property or from liability for damage or insured cause to a third party. So, how does this insurance thing work? Actually, there is a multitude of different types of insurance policies available and virtually any individual or business can find an insurance company willing to insure them for a price. Then the most common types of personal insurance policies are the auto, health, homeowners and life. Most individuals in the United States have at least one of these types of insurance and car insurance is required by law. So, the businesses, they require special type of insurance policies that insure against specific type of risks faced by a particular business. For example, a fast food restaurant needs a policy that covers damage or injury that causes by the result of cooking with a deep fryer. An auto dealer is not subject to this type of risk but does require coverage of for the damage or injury that could occur during the test drives. So in order to select the best policy for you or your family, it is important to pay attention to the three critical components of most insurance policies, the deductible, the premium and the policy limit. So there are also insurance policies available for very specific needs such as kidnap and ransom, medical malpractice, professional liability insurance, also known as errors and omissions insurance. So what is personal finance insurance? Um, it was the review given by Julia Kagan, reviewed by Charles Porters, and it was updated on March 30th, 2021. So it says that insurance is a contract represented by a policy in which an individual or entity receives financial protection or reimbursement against losses from an insurance company. The company pools clients' risks to make payments more affordable for the insured. Similarly, that insurance policies hedge against the risk of financial losses, big or loss, damage to insured, the property or liability for damage, injury to any third party. So the insurance is a multitude of different kinds of insurance policies available and people can access them virtually and uh, the company can insure them about their policy for a price and the most common type of personal insurance as we discussed the same article says that our health or to homeowners and uh, in the u.s car insurance is required by law so what are the key takeaways insurance is a contract in which an insurer indemnifies another against losses from specific contingencies or perilous there are many types of insurance policies, life, health, homeowners and auto are the most common forms of insurance and the core components that make up most insurance policies are the deductible, policy limit and the premium. Business requires special type of insurance policies that insure against specific types of risks faced by a particular business, for example, fast food restaurant that would require a different kind of insurance policy they would 
see what can be the risks uh, for example it can be a risk that can happen as a result of cooking with a deep fryer auto dealer is not subject to this type of risk but does require coverage for any kind of uh, damage or the loss now in order to get to know about a policy and while choosing a policy it is important to understand how it works and what are the insurance policy components. A firm understanding of these concepts goes a long way in helping you choose the policy that best suits your needs. For instance, the whole life insurance may or may not be right type of life insurance for you. There are three components of any type of insurance that are premium, policy limit and deductible that are crucial. So talking about them. The premium type of policy, it is a policy whose premium and a policy's premium is its price. Typically expressed as a monthly cost, the premium is determined by insurer uh, based on your and your business risks profile which may include credit worthiness. For example, if you own several expensive automobiles and have a history of reckless driving, you will likely pay more for an auto policy than someone with a single mind range sedent and a perfect driving record. However, different insurers may charge different premiums for similar policies, so the price that is right for you requires some alleged work. The policy limit is maximum amount and insurance will pay under policy for a covered loss. Maximum may be set per period, annual or policy term per loss or injury or over the life of policy also known as lifetime maximum typically higher limits carry higher premiums for a general insurance policy the maximum amount the insurer will pay is referred to as the face value which is the amount paid to a beneficiary upon the death of insured deductible is a specific amount the policyholder must pay out of pocket before the insurance or the insurer pays a claim so the deductibles serve as deterrents to deterrents to large volumes of small and insignificant claims deductibles can pay per policy per claim dependent on the insurers and type of policy policies with high deductibles are typically less expensive because the high out of pocket expense generally results in fewer small claims and special considerations you need to make are that with regard to health insurance people who have some chronic health issues or they have a need for regular medical attention they should look for the policies with some lower deductibles because otherwise it would get too expensive for them to afford and though the small premium is higher than a comparable policy with a higher deductible and it is less expensive access to the medical care throughout the year so it may be worth the trade-off for you so conclusively i would like to say that take time to sh shop around and find right insurance for your situation people often say they cannot afford insurance but the reality is that they cannot afford not to have it it can save them from thousands or more dollars in unplanned expenses when an unexpected situation will raise and you do not want to waste your money on policies that do not meet your needs but the right insurance policy can protect you and your family for from unforeseen disasters so you better do your homework on it and then surely go for it whatever suits you and whatever can be according to your liability so that was all for today i hope you did like the video and if it was informative for you kindly like the video do not forget to subscribe the channel and press the bell icon so that you regularly get notified whenever we upload a new video for you also do like the video and tell us in the comments that was it informative or not do not forget to share the video with your friends and family. See you soon in another other video. Till then, take care. Have a good day and bye-bye.